Well, good morning, girls and boys, and welcome back to Sunday School. It's a wonderful day. The sun is shining and the birds are singing. Let's start off with a word of prayer. Can everybody put, get your hands, put them up in the air? Very good. Bring your hands together. Bring them down. Close your eyes. Close your mouth. Let's talk to Jesus. Dear Lord Jesus, thank you so much for this wonderful day. Thank you for all the blessings that you have blessed us with, Lord God. I pray that you'll be with us as we uh, sit and listen to our lessons today. Please help us to glorify you. In your holy and precious name I do pray. Amen. Well, let's start off with a special song. Who's got a song request? Hmm. Oh, Zoe. You have a song request, Zoe? Guess what Zoe wants to sing? Zoe wants to sing Jesus loves the little children of the world. What a wonderful idea. I love that song. Okay, everybody get your actions ready and we're going to sing Jesus loves the little children. Jesus loves the little children All the children of the world Red and yellow, black and white They are precious in his sight Jesus loves the little children of the world Jesus loves the little children All the children of the world Red and yellow, black and white They are precious in his sight Jesus loves the little children of the world Well done guys, that was good singing Now last week we sang Count Your Blessings the first verse of Count Your Blessings and I was thinking today we can sing the second verse of Count Your Blessings but before we do how many blessings did you count? Did you have any blessings this week? Well I had a blessing last night I had a blessing which actually probably came because of lockdown now I don't like lockdown I don't like not being able to see you I miss you all so much but last night we had a girls' prayer meeting on Zoom and I got to pray with a lady which I'd never prayed with before and you know what? It was a real blessing and I think that no matter what situation we're in, you know, Paul says, I have learned in whatsoever state I am therewith to be content. So let's start counting our blessings. Ready? We're going to do verse 2 of Count Your Blessings. Seem heavy, you were called to bear. Count your many blessings, every doubt will fly, and you will be singing as the days go by. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your blessings, see what God has done. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your many blessings, see what God has done. Good, but I think some of you might still be a little bit sleepy. You know what we need to do, Mr. James? I think we need to do an action song. Everybody, show me your muscles. Oh, not bad. I need someone with very big, strong muscles to do. My God is so big. Now, who do we have with nice, big, strong muscles? Hmm, do we have Mr. Ike or hmm, whoever do we have? Ah! Oh, Mr. Tan! Hello, oh, Mr. Tan. Oh, oh, oh. Mr. Tan has got, you know, Mr. Tan has some of the biggest, strongest muscles that you've ever seen. Oh! oh, 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 oh. Wow! Mr. Tan, you came at just the right time. I did? Oh, well, you did. Mr. Tan, all these kids in Sunday school, they need, they need to wake up. In fact, everybody stand up. We need you to all stand up. And Mr. Tan, can you show us how you do your push-ups? Push-ups. Mr. Tan. Okay, guys, this is a challenge. I want to see if you can do push-ups like Mr. Tan can. I don't think you can. Do you think they can, Mr. Ted? Oh, let's go. Okay, ready? Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
nine, ten, eleven, oh, what are you twelve, doing? thirteen, fourteen, oh, yeah. fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Oh. Well done. Well, did you all keep up with Mr. Tan? He was pretty good, wasn't he? But you know what? Nobody is bigger or stronger than God. So get your muscles on. We're going to sing, My God is so big. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do. That's true. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do. That's true. The mountains are his, the valleys are his, the stars are his handiwork too. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do. That's true for you. Very good. Now what song shall we do next? Mr. John, you've got your hand up. Read your Bible, pray every day. What a great song. That's exactly how we learn to grow and we grow big and strong. You know, I'm sure you're tired after all those push-ups, so let's do a bit of a stretch before we sing the next song, shall we? Let's stretch. Up in the air. Touch your toes. Out nice and wide. That's good. Move your hands around, move your feet. Let's sing the next song. Well, we're going to do read your Bible, pray every day. Can you all put your Bibles open? And what happens when you read your Bible and you pray every day? <gasps> That's right, Amalia. You grow, grow, grow. Let's sing it, shall we? Read your Bible, pray every day, pray every day. Pray every day, read your Bible, pray every day, and you grow, 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 and you grow, 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 and you grow, grow, grow. Read your Bible, pray every day, and you grow, grow, grow. Now what happens if we stop reading our Bibles? <gasps> Let's sing the second verse. Neglect your Bible, forget to pray, forget to pray, forget to pray. Neglect your Bible, forget to pray, and you shrink, 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 oh, and you shrink, 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 no, oh, and you shrink, shrink, shrink. Neglect your Bible, forget to pray, and you shrink, shrink. Oh no, we're all tiny. Let's read our Bibles again, quickly. Read your Bible, pray every day, pray every day, pray every day. Read your Bible, pray every day, and you grow, grow, grow. And you grow, grow, grow. And you grow, grow, grow. Read your Bible, pray every day, and you grow. Grow, grow, very good. You know, there was another song which I don't know if we've sung in Sunday school before. It's called Let the Lord Have His Way in Your Life Every Day. So we'll sing that maybe two times so you can learn that one and we can sing it all together when we're back in Sunday school. It's a wonderful lesson about how when Jesus Christ is in control, we have peace. goes like this. One, two, three. Let the Lord have his way in your life every day. There's no rest, there's no peace until the Lord has his way. Place your life in his hands, rest secure in his plans. Let the Lord, let the Lord have his way. Do you think you can sing that one with me? Let's try that, shall we? Ready? One, two, three. Let the Lord have his way in your life every day. There's no rest, there's no peace until the Lord has his way. Place your life 
in his hands, rest secure in his plans. Let the Lord, let the Lord have his way. Very good, very well done. Well, now comes the most exciting time. We're going to break up into classes. So, everyone who is in Mr. Wizard's class, we're going to, oh, oh dear, oh no, I nearly forgot. <gasps> Last week, we had a special colouring in competition with a verse. Can anyone remember what the verse is? Let's say it together. Galatians 6, 7. Be not deceived. God is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. Now, this week, we're going to have a very special competition. We're going to send through a little link which has a whole sheet of Bible verses. And the person who can say the most Bible verses when we're back in Sunday school is going to get a very special prize. So, now there's some rules. The verses need to be word perfect and you can say it to your Sunday school teacher and they'll come tell me and whoever says the most is going to get a very special prize. So keep that in mind while you're in your lockdown. You memorize those Bible verses and we'll see you very soon. Well, we're going to break up into our classes now. So everyone who's in Amawes's class, go and click on the link which has Amawes. If you're in Mr. G's class or Mr. B's class, Who's giving the lesson there today, Uncle Sami? Aha, Mr. L, Uncle Lulu. If you're in Uncle Lulu's class, click on the link which is Uncle Lulu. And if you're in my class, Mr. Hayden has a very special lesson prepared. So click on the link for Mr. Hayden. We'll be asking questions about what you learned when we get back. See you next week.